Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Leo. What karma are they facing for June 2024? You can apply this to any of your placements. We are, to, we are going to take a look at the person that you are dealing with, thinking of, was dealing with. We're going to see how this person did you dirty, and then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, and what karma this person is currently facing or world is moving forward. So apply this to your own unique situations, okay? Um, you may switch the roles if you want. It could be karma that you're cycling through. Keep in mind that these are are general messages take what resonates and leave the rest behind if this message didn't resonate with you you may take a look at your other placements keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um taurus people we're doing taurus um if you're looking for a reading that's specific to your unique situations and your energies i suggest you to book a personal reading with me the uh, link for that is in the description box below like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post want to go live also if you guys are interested in following me on tiktok instagram my other youtube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels the links for those are in the description box below support me on there too oops so Hold on one second. All right, so tell me about Taurus. The person that Taurus was dealing with, is dealing with, thinking of, how did this person do Taurus dirty? How did this person do Taurus dirty for June 2024? For Taurus, for Taurus, for Taurus, for Taurus, for Taurus. We have the Judgment card and the Magician, Gemini, Virgo. We have the Three of Pentacles and the Sun, Leo Energy. And the Five of Pentacles here and the Temperance card, Sagittarius Energy. How did this person do you dirty? I do feel like this person created a lot of conflict in your life here. And I do feel like it has something to do with finances. This person took advantage of you financially here. I feel like they basically made themselves look like they were a damsel, you know? And I feel like you felt bad for this person. I feel like you helped them. And I feel like this person completely took you took advantage of you or took you for granted here, okay? You realize what this person was doing. I, okay, I feel like this person was mooching off you. This person was freeloading off you here. We have the Judgment card and the Eight of Swords. Yeah, you're basically your guides and your angels or your ancestors were like, watch out for them because the, they are doing something to you where this person is taking and taking and taking from you. Now, this person could be also was taking from you energetically here too. You know, I feel like this person has no plans of actually building a future with you, but this person was there to take. Uh, you were probably radiating, perhaps you radiate some sort of energy that this person's attracted to. Perhaps, you know, you show that you have a, a, a very abundant life or that you have a very good lifestyle and they feel like this person wanted a part of that, okay? Yeah, whoever this is, you know, I do feel like there was conflict and change in the situation here. You know, I feel like you had to make some changes for yourself so that you could protect yourself here. Your guys and your angels and your ancestors were basically protecting you here, okay? I do feel like at some point, you know, I do feel like you were very happy with this person, but when you realize what this person was doing here, that completely changed and completely shifted here, okay? Some of you guys could already, some of you guys could still be dealing with this person. Yeah, some of you guys could be some of you guys could be still dealing with this person. Some of you guys are seeing a lot of synchronicities of five, 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 five. So this is a time for change here. Or you know, if you're looking for change or that you're looking to get out, this is the time to do it. What else do we have here for Taurus? What else does Taurus need to know? Look out for work on. Uh, what karma is this person currently facing or will face moving forward for June? For June. For June 2024. So we have the Three of Cups here and the Eight of Cups. Three of Cups and the Eight of Cups. We have the Justice card and the Ten of Wands. Justice and the Ten of Wands. And then we have the Chariot and the Nine of Pentacles. Okay. 
but the karma that they're facing is that you are walking away and you're dropping them like a hot potato here. Basically, you're freeing yourself from the situation here, okay? And I feel like you are going to financially recover. I don't, I feel like this person is codependent. I do, don't feel like this person is able to stand on their own two feet because I feel like this person was basically coddled a lot as a child. You know, I feel like this person was you know, handed things to them. Like, I feel like this is a person that sort of like grew up with a silver spoon in her mouth. Like, I do feel like this person does have things here, but I feel like this person consistently relies on other people in order for them to feel fulfilled or happy, okay? So, uh, you know, whatever this is, I do feel like this person's already facing their karma here because of that, because you're distancing yourself from this person. You know, you're doing some soul searching. You're working on yourself here, Taurus. We have the Eight of Cups here and the Seven of Swords and the Justice card here and the Emperor Aries energy. Yeah, this is someone that here, yeah. Oh, here's the thing. I do feel like this person is associated with like a very, like a kind of like a very prominent parent in the community here, this person has a lot of power. And I feel like this person uses their name to their advantage here. And I feel like that's exactly what this person did to you. And I feel like when this person gets in trouble because of the name that they have, they can't get away with it. So I feel like that's why this person behaves the way that they do. Is that anything that they have done in life, they get away with it. They get what they want. This person always gets what they want. Seems like this person, you know, was put on the pedestal as a kid and you feel like this person can do no wrong or that this person's like amazing or that this person feels like they're Hercules. We have the Six of Cups, the Ten of Wands, the Chariot and the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Wands here. Aries, Gil, Sagittarius, Energy, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This person's definitely chasing you around here. We have the Five of Wands, we have the Six of Swords, we have the Eight of Pentacles, and the Hierophant, and the Seven of Pentacles here. This person's all about the money here. Yeah, this person's all about the money. You know, and it's to feed their ego and their bad behavior here. Yeah, it makes them feel powerful that they could control you here. And I feel like when they lose control of you here, you know, I feel like this person will kind of go bananas here, or that this person will get pissed off or mad. And when they lose control of you, you know, that is the karma that the person's going to face here, too. I do feel like this person is very codependent. A codependent in a way where I feel like this person just needs constant admiration, you know, being put on the pedestal here because I feel like someone's parent did that to this person here. Basically, this person grew up in a household where I feel I also feel like this is a single child here too this person always gets what they want I feel like you know I feel like you don't want to feed to this monster anymore you know and I feel like you're trying to free yourself from perhaps this karmic situation here too I do feel like this is a karmic yeah you're cutting off the karmic basically and that is their karma and I feel like you're trying to free yourself from, from this karma too because, you know, the, the energy is, is being latched onto you here. So Taurus, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.